I've got Jax out and he's getting ready to head home. So we wanted to put a little bit on tape, show you where he finished up at. Um, he spent the last couple of days up in the office with me, transferring videos, doing some things. Um, and I've got a bed in the office and I just make him go lay down. And when he gets up, I just send him right back to that bed and make him go lay down. I, I reach down and praise him every once in a while. I'll just reach over and give him a treat. Good boy. Good. Yeah, that was very good. And if he gets up, I just correct him and make him lay back down. So um, I do think it's doable to make Jax an office dog. You know, he's done very well. Um, sometimes when I release him, I let him go say hi to the other employees. You know, my dogs, they understood that if I said, okay, they could come over to the counter and visit. Um, so, you know, you can teach him some of that. You can teach him when it's okay to get up and go say hi to somebody when it's not that sort of thing. He's very teachable anyways. But um, so I've got all of my equipment in my pockets. It's kind of funny to work jacks because I've got treats, I've got a ball, and then I've got a rope. And that's what I'm going to show you. That's what we've been working on with the potty and things. So, um, but I'm going to put him through his basics and then I'll kind of go over a few of the extras. Ready? Okay. Good job. Good. Just make sure he knows that once you say okay, he can get up and get off. All right, come on, let's go. Hey, pay attention. No, 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 no. Good. Stay. Go ahead, stay. Jax is older. He's done some of this, so I didn't hesitate to drop the leash and do a little bit of walking around and talking. Good boy. Good job. I think he knows what's expected of him. The biggest thing with stays and the biggest mistake people make is they just call him. And you really don't want to do that. You want to go back to his side, pick up your leash, and then actually give him the release command. Okay. Good job. And that's where I reward the dogs. Good. Good boy. Ready? Now oh, I got a noisy bird. Let's go. Good. Uh -uh, nope. Good. Yes. Nice job. Thank you for looking at me. Come on, let's go. <laughs> uh -uh. Come on, hurry. Hurry, hurry. Good. Jack, stay. Notice I left him on a sit stay. If he was to lay down from here, I would go over and make him sit back up. And again, it's, 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 you know, it's peanuts to most things. Oh, he's being good. He just laid down. Now, if I was standing here talking to somebody and he laid down, I may not correct it. But honestly, if he's not, if you're not talking to somebody, the problem with him laying down is again, he is wrestling that control. Good boy. Okay. I forgot I angled my camera towards the fence line, so sorry. I hope I wasn't off to camera, but here, sit. Um, so with that in mind, you really want to pay attention to his personality. You know, he kind of likes to call the shots. Oh, um, you know, he was good at stay, but as soon as he thought the stay was over, he got up. He wasn't waiting for that release command, um, you know, as far as that goes. So there's little things. Hey, come on, Jack, skill. Come on. Hey, hurry, 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 hurry. There's little things like that. Ready? Down. No, down. Oh, now you forgot what to do on a down, huh? Down. But there's not a bed there. Yeah, you can still down. Down. Good. No. Stay. <laughs> that was funny. I guess I hadn't done it down on the ground. I've done them on pet beds and he does very well with them. I didn't know that he was going to give me trouble on the ground. So just like that, who was going to win the battle of wills there? He didn't really want to go down. Hmm. Yeah, no, I win. Good. Good boy. Okay. 
Yeah, that was good. Yes, it was. That was a good job. Hmm? All right. All right, here's the fun. I couldn't do get and come games with Jax. He knows come. He knows how to do this. But he likes to play, don't you? Huh? Get it. Hurry! Oops, out of camera. Come! Hurry! Hurry, 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 hurry! Good. Sit. Good job. Good. Come. No one. Oh, wait. Uh uh. Nope. Good. There it is. I get the ball. Ready? All right, get it. Good. Jax, come. Uh, uh, come. No. Come. Sit. And that's hard. That's hard because uh, I'm a border collie. I play with balls. I don't necessarily have to listen to what you say when you say you do it. But yeah, you do. Get it. Good boy, Jax. Come. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Sit. Good. Come. Right here. Hey. Here. All the way. Good. I know it's there. Hey, good job. Oh, good. <laughs> good. One more. All right, get it. Good job. Yeah. Good. Good. All right. So there's my get it comes. Sorry. <laughs> we had to get to be resourceful. Now, here's the last one. I said he can't potty on this leash. So what I've been doing is I've been taking a different kind of leash, which is just one of our kennel ropes, and hooking it on him and letting him go potty. And I've done this all the way around the building. So I've basically gone out to the trees, to the fire hydrant in the front yard, to the fence line, the wooden fence, everything like that. And I've let him go potty on this leash, okay? So what you do is you just go out like... You know, when you go out for the office and stuff like that. Here. Jax, need to go potty? Need to go? Yeah. You can go potty. Good boy. Go potty? Huh? Good. Need to go potty? Huh? We'll try the back fence. Let's go try the wooden fence. Maybe wooden is, is the key. Huh? Is wooden the key? Can you go potty? Good boy. There it is. Good. Good job. Then what I do is I bring him out. I put him back on the training leash. Jack, sit. Good. This one goes back in my pocket. And now we're going to walk along the fence line and I'm going to correct him if he tries to go potty. And I know it sounds mean, but you've had issues with it. And this was the way I thought of fixing it. Good. He said, no, I can't go potty. I'm on leash. I'm not supposed to. See, he's good three feet back from the fence. He won't even get near it. I did the same thing with trees and with the fire hydrant, you know. I just walked him out there and walked him up to it. And if he tried to go potty when he was on leash, I corrected him, told him no. You know, and then I switch leashes and let him go. Good boy. That's the leash you go potty on. Good job. And it can be as simple as prong collar, buckle collar. However you guys think it's going to work. Come on. Where do you, <laughs> what are you doing? Place. Come on, place. Good. Whatever you think that's going to work in your arsenal, that's what I would use with Jax. Good. Okay. Ready? Place. Oh, get up there. Get up there, place. Good. Like I said, we've been doing this in the office. Sit down. Good. Good job. <laughs> that was funny because I didn't have any problems. See, that one went really easily. The one out there on the dark dirt, not so much. Good. Good. Lay down. Good boy. So, that's some of the solutions I think you can use for Jax. I think he's very smart. So, I think anything you want to do, he will do for you. Um, next is socialization. Jax is not an aggressive dog. He doesn't really seem to be at all. He has no issues walking through the kennels. Um, the few times I had him out in the office and stuff, if I checked in dogs, 
I was able to keep him on the bed and the other dogs go by no problem just like I would one of my own so I honestly think that he's probably pretty good at that but here is the thing when you get out and get around other people and dogs other dogs dogs can become unpredictable that's why we hold group classes on Saturday mornings this week we will not be having group classes but all of during the summertime I have them in the morning Right now, since we're still a little chilly in the mornings, we're having them at 2.30 in the afternoon on Saturdays. So anytime you guys want to come out and work with Jax, um, those are group classes and they are absolutely 100% free. And that'll kind of help us to kind of keep working through any issues you may be still having with them if you're having some problems. But um, overall, he has done a great job. Um, you know, he's very smart and he can figure it out. And no, no, more than likely he's going to figure it out before you do. So you might want to make sure you're keeping an eye on what he's paying attention to because sometimes it may be something that is actually a good training moment for both of you. Overall, I think he's done great. So we're going to give him a bath, get him all cleaned up, and we'll see how he does when you get here.